157 is coming out on the man. So 157 is on the mat here. You're looking at All-American. Two years ago, Nick Boggs for Lake Erie College. He is in the green. He is going to be taking on James Weimer. So James Weimer, two Weimers in a row for Finley. Weimer's brother, I'm assuming, had a major decision and lost at the end going for a cradle. But you know what? He was going for it. Shout out to him. This is James Weimer. That was Josh Weimer. So James out there for Finley rocking the right full knee sleeve. He's taking on a Lake Erie College All-American, Nick Boggs. Boggs. An All-American fifth at 149. And Nick Boggs is all gas pedal, folks, as you see. He's in on a deep shot there. Looking to score here. Weimer, shifty, probably why he's wearing that knee sleeve. They're going to stop it. He puts in a bad position. And off the V start here, it's going to be 156 left here in the first period. Scoreless bout between Boggs of Lake Erie College. Weimer tries a little, and there's a nice shot. That was a good two takedown. That was a flash two. That was beautiful. That's why I love college wrestling. And Weimer was up and out there almost, and Boggs somehow remained in control. These are your GMAC Great Midwest Athletic Conference duels here at the University, or Tiffin University. Right now you got a 6 6 dual score. Should be 7 6, but Lake Erie College was deducted a team point for something from their coach. Don't quite know. And, uh,. Could, could uh, result in some interesting things happening here towards the end. So right now, Boggs on top, 2-0 of Weimer. Weimer, University of Finley. Second Weimer in a row, last Weimer. One, seven, two, I want to say, over Lee. And now there's a stall warning on Boggs as Weimer's up and out. So Boggs probably should have cut him five seconds earlier. And... Did it. So once again, as I said earlier, Nick Boggs, all gas pedal, folks. He goes hard. Even if it's his hand fighting, he, he wrestles really hard. And fires off his shot, he leaves his other, hangs his other arm up. 50 seconds set left, and officials gonna, I don't know what they're doing. They're doing something out here. One lead Boggs on a Weimer. 50 seconds remains here. First period. G Mac duels here at Tiffin. You've got Lake Erie College and Finley right out of the gate this morning. What a dynamite duel! And then we got Lake Erie College, Tiffin next round. And to end the day, Finley Tiffin war battle, Northwest Ohio. The teacher and the student, Simcoe versus his former coach, Sean Nelson. And now he snaps it out, goes to a double leg, now single, left-handed for Boggs, 15 seconds. And Weimer hang on here, releases, run the edge of the mat, looks like Weimer's gonna beat that. Hang on, now gets scored on here, five seconds now. And uh, going to the second 2-1 lead, Nick Boggs, Lake Erie College on James Weimer. James Weimer, Josh Weimer won at 149. So, Weimer bros. We got three sets of brothers in a row. That's pretty crazy. We got two Kogowskis, two Leibs, two Weimers. Fun stuff. Weimer Finley up to his feet. University of Finley up and out. 2-2 two -two bout just like that. Weimer's up and out. Boggs unable to keep him down underneath. And it was a quick escape for Weimer. The right time at 38 seconds for Boggs. And a shot again. Boggs left-handed head inside. 
and Weimer's tough to do anything to, and he's gonna pull Boggs' left arm up. Now Boggs not really in a great position actually to score with that left arm. And now he cuts, drops across to a double. And he just quite, can't quite wrangle Weimer down. And Weimer is shifty, hard to wrestle. Russell's hard in every position. And I don't think Boggs is gonna score here. Actually, Weimer's in a, not a bad spot right now. And Boggs does stick with it and gets it, like I said. That's what gas pedal gets you, folks. And you wrestle hard in every position as hard as humanly possible. This is what happens. And he might have busted his eye open. Yeah, he just opened some stitches back up, folks. So, they're gonna have to, this guy regularly gets mummified. So quick shout out to Defense Soap, Defense Soap, Defend What You Built, as Nick Boggs gets his eyebrow put back together. Or temporarily fixed. Coach Breeze, you are not an athletic trainer, but you know what? Is he rocking some defense soap wipes? He absolutely is. Look at this. What a teachable moment, folks. The defense soap wipes. Doing work here. Good job, Coach Breeze. Nice spot. Nice spot. Get it. Get it all. Shout out to Guy Seiko. And uh, defense soap. So Coach Breeze, catch him at the tail end of his... Uh, defense so and they put them back on the table and I'll tell you what they're utilitarian folks get, get it out there coach please get it and Boggs is going to put his uh, face back together literally and uh, coach Breeze wants this match to get going defend what you've built folks defend what you've built I know coach Breeze is doing that right now I saw him Boggs getting taped up, going full mummification mode. And they're gonna put this thing back into action for two leaf Boggs. Weimer, super wily, tough as nails. And Boggs, all taped up. What this guy does. Four two lead, 55 seconds left. Riding time approaching a minute here for Boggs. And he's trying to drop down and up and out. Is Weimer, 4-3, Weimer in this thing. Takedown for Weimer gives him the lead. And it looks like we've got more blood dripping off Boggs. So once again, Boggs bleeding again. And there they come, they're bringing the wipes out. The wipes are the utilitarian folks. This is defense soap wipes. Clean up. Look at that. What a, what a product spot. What a product spot. And Coach Breeze's shoes doing the job too. Not really sure if that's sanctioned, but defending what you build here, Coach Breeze. I know you like to. Fogs over here getting taped up. You might run out of blood time. You actually can. It's crazy. I know in high school you can. I don't think it does, but I don't see it running. I know high school does. Madness. Boggs. Now they put the, the Jason Voorhees mask on. We're ready to go. 4 3 bout. Defenders are built. So. Ready to go. 39 seconds left, 56 seconds of ride time for Boggs. He's got a 4-3 lead on James Weimer. 6-6 six, six duel here. They don't get much closer than this. And not sure what they're talking about. Maybe about lunch plans, something like that. You never know. Oh, no, beautiful shot by Weimer. He can look at the score. And now Boggs tries to roll, and Weimer's going to get a two-point takedown. And the lead, 5-4. Weimer watched the official count up and as he's counting up, releases it. That was awesome. What great wrestling mat awareness by Weimer. And he hard mat returns Boggs. 10 seconds left. And Weimer going to take a 5 4 lead into the third. What a match. Oh, folks. That's the end of the second 5 4 match. Boggs' choice. 
here in the third. He's going underneath. So just let me lay this out to you. Boggs has two takedowns. Weimer has one. Weimer's winning. Weimer covers. Boggs. Quad pod. And now he's got to return him to the matter. They're going to ding Weimer here. And the fighting hands. And up and out is Nick Boggs. Got a 5 5 bout here. This is just how Nick Boggs wrestles, man. And James Weimer steals a beautiful takedown and rides out the end of the second. 130 remaining. We're tied. Shot for Mr. Gas Pedal. Nick Boggs falls in. This gritty. Oh my god. And now we're on the edge. We're off. We're going to get a restart here. Um, let's say it's 7 5 on the board. It's 5 5. So Boggs, Weimer here. Lake Erie College, Shot, Boggs, University of Finley, James Weimer, Josh Weimer, 101.49, so Weimer, Weimer, back to back, here for Finley, looking to pick up two wins and jump start the Oilers to knock off Lake Erie College, and Shot Weimer, counter shot Boggs. Front headlock, 45 seconds left. And quick stalemate, putting them back up on their feet. Weimer, Boggs coming out of the wire here, 43 seconds left. GMAC, dual championships here at Tiffin between Lake Erie College in the green and the University of Finley in the red. 35 now. Weimer doing a great job here. Wrestling his positions with Boggs. Boggs takes a shot. And tell you what, I'm inside of 20 now, underhook now for Boggs, or you can look at an overhook. Oh, there's a club down shot by Boggs. Boggs a low single now. Eight seconds, short time. Looking for it. Weimer, Wiley here, not gonna give it up. And out of real estate, and we're off the mat action the call. We're going overtime. Oh geez, last couple of matches I've done in Nick Boggs. Overtime. So 5-5, five, five, sudden victory here. Boggs, Weimer, 157 pounds. Match is brought to you by Defense Soap. Defense Soap, defend what you built. And Boggs is into this overtime thing, but Weimer can spoil it here for University of Finley. And Weimer can knock off the All-American here. Boggs in on a deep shot. Look at the score here. Nothing yet. Weimer's lived here all match and been in great position. And now he's got him hopping. 34 seconds left in overtime here. And he kicks out of it. Now he takes the shot. And this is how he scored last time. Look at the score. It's Weimer. He had it. Stopped wrestling. Boggs got a cradle. Looking to crack him. Nothing. Two takedown Boggs on the edge. Wow. In continuation, he can actually pin him. Boggs is going to win the match in overtime, but Weimer had him. Wow. And we're off the mat. He still has him in position to pin him. And there it is, Nick Boggs, your overtime king. This guy lives in overtime, folks. And he's gritty, he's tough, and Weimer pushed him. Weimer had him. Weimer absolutely had him in overtime. Convince me otherwise. But Box keeps rustling. Great match.